What's up everybody, it's Shark, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use one of the augmented reality NFTs you have purchased from me. So when you get one of my augmented reality NFTs, you're gonna get a piece of unlockable content, which is a .fbx file. And what this file is, is the augmented reality asset or 3D model with its texture and colors baked into it. So you don't have to do that yourself. It's ready to be rigged and used in content. So when you buy my NFT, you're gonna get this file. And the first thing you're gonna wanna do is download that and then go to Mixamo.com, which is where I am right now. And you're gonna wanna log in, and make an account, it's completely free. I made mine with my Google. So I'm about to log into mine and show you how you can give this character an animation uh, to use in your augmented reality content. So I'm gonna log in, continue with Google. I log in a lot so it has everything of mine saved. So here we are in Mixamo. On the right, you'll see the model that you've imported, and on the left, you'll see a series um, or library of animations that you can rig to your model. So right now, I have a different model in, but I'm gonna upload one of the models that you would get from me if you bought an AR NFT. So I'm gonna go to select character file. I'm gonna grab one of my Shark Boys. We're gonna upload that. So here is my Shark Boy character. I'm gonna press next. And now I'm going to assign um, kind of these nodes to different body parts. So I'm gonna go with the wrist and let me put it right here. I'll put the chin like right here, elbow, edge of the t-shirt, knees, somewhere in the middle, looks good. Groin, I put it like kind of like right by the belt. And then here under skeleton LOD, you're gonna wanna click no fingers because my guy, he has, a, he has no fingers. <laughs> we'll get to that in a future model maybe. I'm gonna press next and now it's gonna rig um, the character. So it's gonna assign um, these areas I've selected to be those body parts that coincide with with the nodes. So I'm gonna give this you know a few minutes to do this. Okay, and here we have Shark Boy. He's rigged up. You can see he kind of has like this standard animation on him right now. Uh, he's just looking around, but he looks good. He looks he looks like he's moving like a normal person would. So I like it. I think he's good to go. I'm gonna press next. So to the left, you can search. Um, for animations that are in categories. So I normally go to dance and these are the animations that I can put on my character um, And then send to my phone to use for augmented reality stuff. So let's do Let's do the up rock this is a classic. Let's use uh, Do we want to use the up rock? I mean, do we want something like what's this? Yeah, he's breaking it down and these controls are pretty robust on the, uh, on the, on the right hand side You can definitely see what this guy is doing Okay, I think I'm gonna go with that one because this this thing is pretty dope and it looks like he's he's having a good time. Yeah, I, I love this. So I'm gonna send this to Arrow. I'm gonna click this button right here, send to Arrow. And then I'm gonna send to Arrow. Now what this is doing is it's uploading uh, the character with this animation to my Creative Cloud files, which is basically um, where you would store things you've created in Adobe. Um, and that's why we had to make a profile to get into Mixamo. So now if I go on my phone, and I open up Adobe Arrow, it's gonna allow me to pull this guy and this dance move from the cloud and onto my phone to start using it in, in augmented reality. So for this part of the video, we are gonna be on our mobile device. I'm gonna be using a cell phone, but you can use an iPad. And we're gonna be on the Adobe Arrow app. It's a free app on the App Store. I know there's a version of this app that is on the Android store, but I am not an Android user, so I don't know much about it or its functionality. So if this is you, please give it a go, but I'm not sure if it'll have the same results as the Apple version. So here we are in the Adobe Arrow app, and you're going to want to press the blue plus sign in the bottom right part of the application. So now the Adobe Arrow app is going to try and find a surface where you can place the augmented reality asset. This can be a horizontal or vertical surface, but it may take some playing around to get right. So spend some time on this part of the process and find what works best for your location. Now that Arrow has found a surface, tap somewhere on the surface to add an anchor. This is where you're gonna place your augmented reality character to start having them interact in the space. So now we're gonna press the plus sign in the bottom left corner and open up the Creative Cloud. Here, we'll be able to see all of the augmented reality stuff that I have sent to my cloud. We're gonna grab the latest one, which is the Hip Hop Dancing Shark Boy. Click open. 
and then now it'll play Shark Boy where I set my anchor. I'm gonna grab him, expand him using my two fingers, make him as big or as little as you want. Now that he's looking good, you're gonna wanna tap Shark Boy, click on the behaviors option in the bottom, it's in the middle, click add a new trigger, click start, add a new action, then add an animation. Hip Hop Dance will be there, that's what's been selected for him. You wanna scroll down to the bottom and enable infinite. Now when Shark Boy plays, he will loop his animation endlessly for you. Looks like we're all good to go. Now we're gonna switch to the preview window. It's in the very top, click preview. And now Shark Boy is doing his animation and you'll be able to press record and film to your camera on the bottom or you can use the snapshot feature and take pictures of Shark Boy hitting random poses in his animation. So have fun with this, post it on social media, tag one of my songs. This is what I've been doing for months on Instagram. It's been a lot of fun and I hope all of you enjoy collecting my augmented reality characters. See you in the next one. Peace.